Look at the beacon bars. Okay, we are dropping in now, and hopefully... Okay, we're here in Dead City with the power hangar. And we do have that ECU Favnir still in our hangar. We got three Favnirs, two Revenant. Okay, uh, yeah, let's go ahead and drop in our Revenant first. Uh-oh, I'm seeing some Vox players on the other side. Uh-oh. This is going to be tough. I am not in a squad right now. So this is... How many Vox guys are there? There's one, two, three... There's at least three Vox guys. Could be a full squad. I don't know. This is going to be a tough game, but... We're going to go up or down fighting. Okay, we're just going to keep... If this guy wants to keep running backward, we're going to grab the beacon, man. Uh-oh, here's a guy. Darn it. I thought we could just grab this beacon and that Orochi was going to keep running back. Oh, maybe we can. Okay, my teammate's on this beacon with me. He's using me as a meat shield. Okay, sweet. We actually secured this side left beacon. Boom, there's a kill. There's a kill. That is an Orochi. Boom, there's a double kill. That is a double kill. Uh-oh, our physical shields are blown off. Uh-oh, now we might be in trouble. This is three guys here. That's a we dealt some good damage to that revenant, but we got taken out. Okay. Um, where should we drop in here? Um, there looks like they're pushing center pretty hard. But I don't want to drop into center because you don't want to just drop in, especially against high-level players. You don't want to just drop in when there's a swarm of them coming out of beacon, because you probably won't protect the beacon, and you're just going to lose a robot. Okay, let's try to get this beacon first. If no one comes over here, let's just snag this. Oh! Somebody's definitely coming over here. Come on, let's melt him. Oh, he's melted. He's melted. Melt! Melt! Oh, we, oh, we ran out of ammo! Yes! Kill! Oh, no, now we got to back off. Oh! Someone can trigger that guy's last stand. Okay, it's fine if they hold that beacon because we have their beacon for now. So if they have three beacons, it's not going to drain our bar really fast. But if they get four, that would be an issue. I don't know what this guy is, but we're melting him pretty good. Is that a tier? Oh, that really is a tier. I see a lot of tiers in Champion League for some reason. I don't know why. Like, the tier is not... The Mender is definitely better. Yes! Okay, he's dead. And we got taken out. And we got taken out. Okay, let's drop in. Favnir. ECU Favnir. And we do have a quantum radar on here, but I'm not sure if that's going to be useful because I don't know how many Roshis are out right now. Okay, boom. There's one kill. We lost a lot of health there, though. I love how the quantum radar, when you hit it, it sounds like a... It sounds like when your seat belt is undone and you're driving in a car and it goes... Da, 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 da. <laughs> you don't know what I mean, replay this clip. Replay it. Okay, they're pushing... Uh, okay, this is now not good. Now they actually have four beacons. And four beacons is a recipe to win for them. Okay, we're trying to chew up that guy. Oh, no. Come on. Boom. Yes. Our, e our ECU shield is keeping us protected on that one side. And we did take out that Favnir. Triple kill. Okay, that is good. The problem is, I don't think we're going to be able to mech out these guys. So, I think we have to win on the beacon bar. And they have the beacon bar lead. Wait, what? Oh, gosh. They're pushing this beacon. Oh, no. Oh, no. Like, especially with solos, when you're facing a squad, it's not a good chance you're going to be able to mech out the enemy team. Like, that's pretty hard to do in general. And especially against high-level players. Okay, I'm trying to just isolate this Favnir and have that Orochi not fire at me. Come on. Boom, there we go. Okay, we killed him. 
Should we drop in here? Oh, maybe. Oh, no. Oh, I thought that guy was running away. Damn it. Damn it. He last in triggered, but, uh... Uh, we're gonna lose. We're gonna lose the beacon. We're gonna lose it. Ah! Okay, they're pushing, man. Our beacon bar is really draining, but we're gonna keep fighting. Okay, let's drop in our corrupted Favnir. We have our luchador after this. I think it's it's now or never. If you are on a team, you're gonna eventually, no matter, every player at one point is in this case, where your team is down big on the beacon bar. And if you don't do something, the game's gonna be over. At that point, just throw everything you got. Who cares if you sacrifice a robot? Do whatever it takes to just get some beacon bar. Like, I'm just going in here. Oh, my teammate is on the beacon below, so I can actually protect him from up here. That was a tough game. It was hard to believe that we were actually gonna win that, because there was a squad of Vox players for sure. Vox, Vox, 3.5 million, two. Oh, it was only two guys, eh? Jeez, I guess just the two was enough. Two was enough. Okay, we are here on Dreadnought. We are here on Dreadnought. I can't be the only one who notices that some some like nights or some days you'll land on the same map like five times and then you won't even see other maps i don't know if that's random or like if pixon excuse matchmaking or something so that you only oh here's a blitz oh we're ripping this guy oh this guy's getting absolutely shredded up Whew, that guy was even some flames man This is a weird build on the Orochi he's got. He's got like a hell and a puncher. Boom! Kill. Bad news is we have good news is we have center. The bad news is enemy team's got a four cap. So what that means is we gotta teleport over here and help out my teammate. See you later. Boom! One clip, we melted that Orochi. The problem is since we there's two guys here, we can't. Just grab the beacon back, because they're just going to keep dropping in. Triple kill. That's a traditionalist falcon. The, tradi the traditionalist falcon lost a lot of momentum when, you know, when the super durable Fenrir was out. And now robots can deal so much damage that you can actually kill the traditionalist falcon. Before, it would take like five minutes to shoot one, or kill one. Now with nuke amplifiers and these crazy weapons, you can deal a whole lot of damage. I mean, it still takes a while, but... Then again, we only have one heavy and two light here. Like, this isn't even a super high damage build. Come on. Yes! Rampage! Rampage! Okay, if we can... Oh my gosh! We're getting this beacon back, but the enemy team's got four beacons again. Okay, we have to get out of here. I'm worried that that Fabnir's just gonna get the beacon back. Okay, no, my teammate is there. So we need to get center. Is this another traditionalist falcon? This team likes their traditionalist falcons, man. Okay, me and my teammate, we're trying to kill this guy, man. Okay, boom, there we go. Finally, okay, we have three beacons now. Our beacon bar did take a hit. We're down to like a third. But we finally got three, and that's going to help us out a little bit here. Okay, okay. Teleport over. Interesting build. Nucleon and Scatty. Okay, we locked him down. If we can grab this beacon, that would be superb! Ah! Last hand triggered. Oh, we're getting orbital strike too. Oh, we changed the beacon white, but we couldn't hang in there. There were too many of them. Okay, flamethrower rev. We're going flamethrower rev again. Whoa, we got pushed. A bit of lag, bit of lag. Bit of lag. Come on. 
Come on, man. Boom, double kill. There we go. Oh, here we go, here we go. We can kill this guy. Okay. Jeez, it's 2-2 two, two beacons right now. Act they might be getting a third. Damn, they're getting a third! And they're dropping in their titans, which means... Bigger robots with more durability to take down. There's still six minutes to go as well. Gosh. Come on! I don't even... I guess we should drop in our fav near. Oh, we're a little bit underneath here, but I think we can take a... What is that, a Punisher Typhon? And here is a... If you guys didn't know this, hold on, let's kill this. This is a little trick. If you're already flying, we can just glide all the way up, and then we gain way more elevation on our flying. And we don't have to stop gliding. Here we go. Okay, we're trying out here. Like, it's 2-2 two, two beacons. Our beacon bar is so far behind, though. Oh, this is risky. This is super risky. We shouldn't have done it. Ah! Oh! I thought we could grab this beacon, but the guy dropped in right away. Uh-oh, center's under, under attack. Center is under attack. He's in center. What the heck is this guy doing? Probably not a smart move for him. Okay, there. My teammate dropped him. We have this four and a half minutes to go. We have three beacons. And there's full players on both sides. Here's an Ares. We should be able to take this guy out fairly easily. He doesn't even have a last stand. Yes, kill. There we go. Is that another Ares? What is that? Okay, if we can get inside this Erebus shield and just torch him. The problem is there's a Muramids right behind us. Okay, double kill. Okay, come on, come on, come on. Oh! Okay, we don't have this beacon secured, but it's white, which means nothing's happening. It's at least not red, so we changed it. Oh no, my teammates. Come on, teammates, where are you? I'm gonna need help here. Wait, they're pretty low health, actually. I might be able to do this. Wait, where'd that blitz go? Did that blitz just die? I guess he died. We now have a four cap. We have a four cap. That guy was taken out. We're gonna push five. I think we need five. It's three and a half minutes. We, I think we're gonna need five beacons. What is this guy doing? Is he AFK? I don't know. I think he's AFK, so let's just aim this. No, we're losing C! We're losing C! Just want to get this guy out of here in case he comes back to life. Okay, Rampage. See, this is... Why can this Favnir hold his beacon if he's flying? That shouldn't be a thing. Oh! He's going to get that beacon back. Oh, they're getting D beacon A or something as well. Nope. Maybe? I don't know. Okay, we're gonna take off. We're gonna glide. This is why I wish I had three Nitro units on my Favnir. To push beacons. Okay, they have one beacon. We're getting beacon A back. This guy's gonna come at me for sure. This guy's coming at me. I could just drop my luch. Worst case, I'll just drop my luchador in. Can we hold this beacon while flying, though? See, I don't understand why this is a thing, but whatever. We, we just want to be sure. Boom, he's almost dead. Come on, kill him. Boom, kill. No! We lost center. Oh, now we're screwed. I honestly think if we had more time, I could win this. 
But now we have three beacons. Oh my gosh, wait, look at the beacon bars. Look at the beacon bars. Oh! Are you serious? The beacon bars were like the same. I thought we had three beacons, so we were going to win it. Oh, that is a huge letdown. That absolutely sucks. I thought we were going to win that with our three beacons. That was a super close game. All right, guys, I'll probably wrap it up there for that one. All right, guys, until next time, peace, SpaghettiOs.